Yeah. <coughs> my name is Honorable Kibruto Kimosop, the MCA Monchongoi uh, Ward. We want to, I want from the onset, say that we have seen some operation, some good work happening in Silale and parts of Tirio, uh, Riongo and some other parts. We saw it yesterday and I want to take this opportunity as an area that is affected by banditry, as a representative of people who are victims of banditry, to actually register our full support to the operation that the government has started in Tiati and any other area that there are bandits. We support fully. Our confidence is with the regional com uh, commissioner, Banana Tembea, and the county police commander, Wanandiwa. You have our full confidence in running this operation in, in, in Tiati <clears throat> and other parts that there are problems of panditry. We have really suffered. We have lost people. We have parried people. We have lost livestock and several people displaced. The area we are in now, we have a lot of people who got displaced as a result of this, uh, this banditry. And we have been pushing for a long time. In fact, to us, it's still unbelievable that finally we can see some semblance of uh, disarmament. So we want to assure the government through the regional commissioner, Banana Tembea, and the county commander, we want to assure you that you have our full support, 100% uh, support. And I say this with authority, uh, as one of the leadership in Baringo County, that we support this and let nobody intimidate you or blackmail you or make comments that are ridiculous. However, we have gotten comments, ridiculous comments made by uh, Kamget, that you know this has happened uh, in a manner that is not fair, that we are likely to arm ourselves and engage in self-defense. We want to tell Kamget, Kamget, a disarmament is not a church choir. It's not an impeachment proceeding. It's not a, de a, a debate, a county assembly or a national assembly debate. A disarmament is a disarmament. It is an operation against the bandits, against terrorists, against the people who have guns, who have arms, and who have sophisticated weapons, even sometimes more than the government. And it is wrong for you, after failing for so many years to stop your people from coming to steal from us, and to stop your people from coming to maim our people, and, 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 and inflict the kind of pain that has inflicted us, that now you have the guts to threaten the government. And this is where we want to tell Wafula. We saw you just stamping that, you know, anybody that will make ridiculous comments should be arrested. We want to test your comments as the county commissioner Baringo by arresting Kamget. Kamget should be arrested. Who, which, 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 which power, which power does Kamget have to threaten a legitimate government? That you will engage in self-defense. This is a government. This is a government operation. So we are demanding as leadership of this other area that Kamget should be arrested and Kamget has no moral authority at all to threaten anybody because he has never cooperated. Which victims, I mean, which, 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 uh, which uh, criminals have Kamget produced? Which list has he produced? How many criminals have been uh, convicted as a result of uh, Kamget producing whatever list that he has? Uh, produced. So that is what we wanted to say and we are really not going to entertain this kind of comments and we want to even tell our colleagues in the assembly we, if these are the comments that you are making, if you are not supporting the disarmament, then these are comments that we are really not going to entertain at all it is not a conversation we want to have completely. We support this disarmament fully. And what, are, what does the law say? The law is clear that f commensurate force must be used What is a commensurate force of a gun? When you tell us that police should go to where the criminals are hiding, where are the criminals hiding? Can you tell us? Can you tell us where the criminals are hiding? We are talking about people who have guns. So you want the police officers to go there with bare hands and, and engage in church choir? And engage in a debate of where they are? When you say we should not ban that shop or we should not ban that uh, uh, building, then where are the criminals? Suppose, suppose it is suspected they are inside those buildings. Suppose it's suspected they are inside those buildings. So that is, that is the position uh, we really support. And by the way, if this is the direction that the county security team will take, 
then they have our 100% support. And we are ready to mobilize the whole Baringo to come out and demonstrate peacefully in support of this disarmament. Majina mimi naitwa Joseph Tarus. Mimi ni wakili na mmoja wa viongozi hapa Baringo. Tumekuja hapa kama viongozi kusema neno moja tu kwamba sisi wakaaji wa Baringo na aswa Baringo ya Kusini. Sisi tunaunga mkono operation ile inaendelea upande ule wa Tiati. Ama namna gani wananchi? Si namna hiyo. Eh, namna hiyo kwamba sisi hatutaki kusikia makelele ya kando kando. Makelele ya kando kando hatutaki. Tunataka serikali ijue kwamba sisi wakaaji wa hapa. Sisi tuna support, sisi tunaunga mkono hiyo operations na tunasema wakora wote watolewe kutoka tiati na baada ya hiyo sisi tunataka ngombe yetu ngombe wala ambao walitolewa hapa Baringo South wote warudishwe manake tunashangaa viongozi wengine ambao wanachiita national leaders kwamba wanasema kwamba atutaki operation pande ule mwingine alafu wakati tunaibiwa pande hii hawapiki kelele lakini tukienda huko kuuliza ngombe yetu wameenda wapi wanapiga kelele sisi tunasema hiyo ni unafik hiyo ni ukora na sisi tuna condemn tunasema operation ifanye nini asante sana sisi tunasema hivi serikali iko na masikio serikali iko na masikio na serikali iko iko hapa kwa ground serikali ifanye kasi yake mtu yoyote ambaye ana interfere mtu yoyote ambaye ana interfere kuna sheria ambayo inasema interference with investigations pia interference with government operations calls for an arrest and therefore anybody who blocks or who stands on the way of the government doing its work must be pushed aside and if he refuses let him be arrested